Hello dear viewers, this is Truck Craft Studios and today we're taking a critical look at a disturbing practice inherent in financial markets, stock spoofing. Recently I found myself wondering why it seems possible for certain stocks to be spoofed for years. What does spoofing even mean? Spoofing refers to the insertion of false trading activities to manipulate the market. Why do regulatory bodies like the SEC and exchanges like NASDAQ allow such practices? A crucial factor could be the limited resource allocation of regulatory bodies like the Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC. Monitoring financial markets is a gargantuan task and often priorities have to be set. Financial markets are extremely complex and spoofing can be hard to detect. Trading strategies vary widely and identifying unusual patterns requires advanced monitoring technologies. Perpetrators are constantly adapting, making detecting spoofing akin to finding a needle in a haystack. The introduction of new regulatory measures is time consuming and requires careful planning. There may be regulatory hurdles preventing the swift implementation of effective safeguards, lack of coordination between regulatory bodies, exchanges and other relevant parties could lead to enforcement gaps. Collaboration is crucial to effectively combat spoofing. In conclusion, there are various reasons why stock spoofing can persist over years. However, it's essential to emphasize that financial markets and their regulation are constantly evolving. It may require enhanced efforts to curb these practices. If you enjoyed this video or want to learn more about financial regulation, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell to stay updated. Also, share your thoughts on this issue in the comments.